Hello Dream Team, welcome to another exciting journey. Today, we dive into the rich and diverse land of Ethiopia. Nestled in the Horn of Africa, Ethiopia is a nation teeming with breathtaking landscapes, ranging from awe-inspiring mountain ranges to serene lakes, and even one of the most extreme environments on Earth, the Danakil Depression. This is a land where history breathes life into the present, with ancient rock-hewn churches and age-old traditions that continue to thrive. Ethiopia's diverse tapestry of cultures is as vibrant as it is varied, with over 80 ethnic groups each adding their unique thread to the weave. The people of Ethiopia, known for their warm hospitality, will welcome you with open arms and hearts, making your journey an experience of a lifetime. Before we embark on this unforgettable journey through the land of origins, please subscribe and share. Ethiopia is known for its ancient civilizations and religious significance. Let's start our journey with the historic roots. When we talk of the historic roots of Ethiopia, three names instantly come to mind. Lalibela, Aksum, and Gondar. Each place is steeped in history and spirituality, holding a unique position in the country's rich heritage. Let's begin with Lalibela, often referred to as Africa's Petra. This UNESCO World Heritage Site is famous for its rock-hewn churches dating back to the 12th century. The 11 monolithic churches, carved directly from the mountainside, are a testament to the architectural prowess of the ancient Ethiopians. These structures have stood the test of time and continue to be places of worship today. Next, we journey to Aksum, the heart of ancient Ethiopia. It was once the center of the Aksumite Empire which dominated East Africa for almost a thousand years until the 10th century AD. Today, Aksum is renowned for its obelisks or stelae, towering granite monuments that punctuate the skyline, some reaching over 70 feet in height. These stelae are believed to mark royal tombs and stand as silent reminders of a powerful past. Our historic route concludes in Gondar, often referred to as Africa's Camelot. Gondar was the imperial capital of Ethiopia in the 17th and 18th centuries. It's home to the royal enclosure, a fortress city containing numerous castles and palaces adorned with beautiful frescoes. Gondar's architecture is a fusion of Portuguese, Indian and local styles, reflecting the city's cosmopolitan history. These historic sites offer a glimpse into Ethiopia's past, making them a must-visit for history buffs. From Lalibela's rock-hewn churches to Aksum's towering stelae and Gondar's imperial castles, each stop on this historic route takes us deeper into the past. They allow us to walk the same paths as ancient civilizations, feel the spiritual energy that still resonates today, and appreciate the historical and religious significance these sites hold. So if you're a traveler seeking a journey through time, the historic roots of Ethiopia are waiting to unfold their stories and secrets to you. From the ancient times, we now move to the breathtaking landscapes of Ethiopia. One of the natural marvels that make Ethiopia a must-visit destination is the Simeon Mountains National Park. Often referred to as the Roof of Africa, this park is a geological wonderland, hosting some of the highest peaks in the continent. It's a paradise for trekkers, offering a challenging terrain that rewards you with views of rugged cliffs, deep valleys, and towering peaks. The park is also home to diverse wildlife, including the endemic Ethiopian wolf, the Gelada baboon, and the majestic Walia Ibex. As you traverse through the park, you might find yourself sharing the hiking trail with these fascinating creatures. From the cool highlands of the Simeon Mountains, we descend into one of the most inhospitable yet stunningly beautiful regions on Earth, the Danakil Depression. This is a place where the Earth bears its soul. It's one of the hottest places on the planet, characterized by lava lakes, acid ponds, and salt flats that stretch as far as the eye can see. The terrain may be harsh, but it's a visual spectacle that's hard to match. The colorful mineral deposits create a surreal, almost alien landscape that leaves a lasting impression on anyone fortunate enough to witness it. The trekking opportunities in the Danakil Depression are not for the faint-hearted, but those who dare are rewarded with an unforgettable experience. Imagine walking on crusty salt flats, witnessing the fiery display of an active volcano, or standing on the edge of a bubbling lava lake. It's an adventure that pushes the limits, allowing you to experience the raw power and beauty of Mother Nature. 
These natural wonders are not just about the landscapes and the wildlife, they are also about the people who inhabit these regions, who have adapted to the harsh conditions and have carved out a way of life that's in harmony with the environment. These natural wonders are a testament to Ethiopia's stunning beauty and offer an adventure like no other. Having explored the natural wonders, let's now immerse ourselves in the vibrant culture of Ethiopia. Ethiopia's capital, Addis Ababa, is the heart of the country's cultural scene. A bustling metropolis, it's a city that never sleeps. From bustling local markets during the day to the pulsating rhythm of its nightlife, Addis Ababa offers an incredible cultural experience. One of the highlights of the Ethiopian calendar is the Timcat Festival. Held every January, this religious celebration commemorates the baptism of Jesus in the Jordan River. It's a vibrant spectacle of processions, traditional music and dance, with locals dressing in their finest traditional attire. But the cultural experience extends beyond festivals. The Ethiopian people are known for their warm hospitality and friendly demeanor. Engaging with the locals, you'll get a chance to learn about their traditions, their way of life, and the deep-rooted customs that define their society. Food is a significant part of any culture, and Ethiopian cuisine is no exception. The local delicacies are a gastronomic delight. Indulge in injera, a sourdough flatbread, served with various stews, or kitfo, a dish of minced raw meat. Then there's shiro, a hearty chickpea stew that's a staple in many Ethiopian households. The nightlife in Addis Ababa is as vibrant as its day life. Bars, clubs and live music venues abound, offering a taste of Ethiopian music and dance. The rhythmic beats of traditional music, combined with the infectious energy of the dance floor, make for an unforgettable night out. And no cultural exploration of Ethiopia would be complete without mentioning the traditional Ethiopian coffee ceremony. An integral part of socializing and hospitality, this ceremony involves the preparation and drinking of coffee, accompanied by the burning of frankincense. It's a beautiful ritual filled with symbolism and an opportunity to slow down, connect and savor the moment. The rich culture and delicious cuisine of Ethiopia are sure to leave you enchanted. As we near the end of our journey, we arrive at the beautiful Lake Tana and the majestic Blue Nile Falls. Embark on an ethereal voyage as we navigate the serene expanse of Lake Tana, Ethiopia's largest lake. Sprawling over 2,000 square kilometers, this body of water is more than just a picturesque sight. It's the source of the Blue Nile River, which contributes up to 60% of the Nile's water. The lake is dotted with over 30 islands, each a sanctuary for ancient monasteries and churches, some dating back to the 13th century. An air of tranquility envelops these secluded isles, where centuries-old traditions continue to thrive. Visitors can soak in the serenity, learn about the rich history, or simply bask in the breathtaking beauty that surrounds them. And then, there's the climactic spectacle of the Blue Nile Falls, locally known as Tisisat, or the Smoking Water. This magnificent cascade, one of the greatest on the continent, is a sight to behold. During the rainy season, the waterfall lives up to its moniker, creating a smoky mist that can be seen from miles away. The thunderous roar of the water crashing down is a testament to the sheer power of nature. Visitors can embark on a trek to reach the falls, navigating lush trails teeming with endemic bird species. The journey is as rewarding as the destination, with panoramic views of the cascading waters and the verdant landscapes. Water sports enthusiasts can also enjoy a variety of activities on Lake Tana, from fishing to boating, offering a unique perspective of this natural wonder. The lake's biodiversity is another highlight, with a rich array of bird life and aquatic species, including the endemic Labiobarbus fish species. The tranquil Lake Tana and the thunderous Blue Nile Falls, each in their own way, encapsulate the magic of Ethiopia. They signify the harmony of serenity and power, history and nature, adventure and tranquility. The tranquil Lake Tana and the thunderous Blue Nile Falls offer a perfect end to this unforgettable journey. And with that we come to the end of our journey through Ethiopia, a journey where we've traced the footprints of history in Lalibela, Aksum and Gondar. We've stood in awe of the breathtaking landscapes of the Simeon Mountains and the surreal beauty of the Danakil Depression. 
We've immersed ourselves in the pulsating energy of Addis Ababa, tasted the flavors of injera and kitfo, and danced the night away in vibrant nightclubs. We've shared in the joy of Timcat Festival and the sacred ritual of the coffee ceremony, and we've soaked in the serenity of Lake Tana and the majesty of the Blue Nile Falls. Each experience, a testament to Ethiopia's intoxicating blend of history, culture, and natural beauty. A land that beckons you to come, explore, and make your own memories. So what are you waiting for? Thank you for joining us on this journey. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exciting adventures. Until next time, keep exploring.